Yo guys, welcome back to another video, and welcome to my Tom, no, you guys are the Thompson fam. If, today I am going to be doing the, the weirdest and the dumbest people on the internet. Now, don't take this too personally, if you had to say the serious people type, so don't forget that, don't forget to remind that to yourself thinking this is a serious video, but I'm, before we even start, I'm, I'll start, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel because you'd never want to for some upcoming videos. Don't forget to like this video because you don't want to, you must, whoop, I'm not drunk, like this video. And don't forget to turn on the little bell, will be on the screen or on three things on this And And um, obviously if you guys want a shout out in my next video, all you got to do is say something nice, like and obviously, and obviously I'll put you guys on the screen because it's something to do with editing and you don't want to do that. So, at further ado, I'm going to be reacting to some of the dumbest people on the internet. So let's go. Now, before we start, it will be on the screen, so don't, sorry, I'll read it off the tablet, but it, it will be on the screen, so I'm actually looking at the, you know what I mean, guys, so, I first, one well, I'm going to move over so you guys can actually see it, it will be on the screen somewhere right now, i am obviously got this so I can read, and obviously look at you guys at the same time, I cut my hair, and it went back to curly, and down and so on and said, don't you mean cut, ha, it passed tense, before we even start, some of these are blurred out, so there's no names, so no names on the screen, so that's a good start, but it's all squiggle lines and lines, so before we've just said that, so, on the, on the screen right now, it's going to be, as someone said, obviously, someone said it was a past tense, and somebody has, not, someone probably means you need to cut your own head, so basically, you, 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 you get this feeling, people means you're supposed to say, you cut your hair. Oh, it means I cut my hair, and it went back to curly. I don't read the question mark. See, and um, before we even start, this person got the sentence wrong. It's supposed to be cut. So you are the dumbest person. You're supposed to say cut, not cute. That's of a part. Of someone says cute on the screen, and you just like now. It's making me, it's making me wait until I'm there. I mean, I started this one photo of this. So, you need to, one, back to go back to school and learn English. And two, you just need to um, learn your grammar as well. Because cute and cut are, they are different. They are similar and different. Cute and cut will be on different. Oh, try and put on the screen, try. And somebody outside when I'm the boy is every time I make a YouTube video, everybody decides to interrupt me when I'm walking past. So like I said, that's, so somebody said, don't you mean cut? Ha, yeah, you need to get that's right. You actually done this sentence for in the first place. So first one is done for you on the screen. There you go. On back onto the number onto the number two or, or what they call it. On done. So. Next one, mm, I think I've got, I've seen your boy with your tablet, we are on the screen because you know I've got editing skills, I'm obviously not be here, it'd be weird and it do not look like I'm doing nothing. So next, on to the second one, my mum and I, my mum and I have tried lying, it wasn't too bad, tastes like pork but isn't complete, completely, but isn't something we would order on a platter. Now, now. I don't know if you get, I don't know if you guys know this, right, but you can't eat lions. Lions, it's ridiculous. You can't eat, unless you try and hunt them down and hurt them, but that's not really suggestive. If you ever, I think you're trying to say you're supposed to you taste pork, not lion, because if you tasted lion, you would not even be here right now. You'd probably be food poisoning by a lion. <clears throat> so, Get that in mind that you don't eat lions. You, you can probably see them in, in the zoo, but you don't eat lions. You're probably thinking you ate pork and it tastes like pork because it's pork. Too many pork in this, in this sentence today. So, I'll tell then third on the screen right now. How is One Direction hashtag one in 37 countries? I thought 
I thought the world only had seven the US self self you you this person don't have to spell again you need to learn back to grammar the US self you Unit States, Africa, Asia, England, and Arctic, and Arctica. I can't say that word. Arctica, that's the word. Now, obviously, I've got the, obviously, just let you know, you've got this completely wrong. There's about, US is the same as the United States. And two, two, well, that's not swearing, because I'm not And two, you spell United States wrong, because you, you put units, unit states. I haven't heard of you in the United States, but let me know in the comments down below if you if you heard the United States, United States. Um, so, but no, it's so like US and United States is the same thing. US, you live in US, you you live in USA. That's it. Just simple. You live in America. You too fair. And I'm not a bit job jobly wobbly. Guys, you need to have. Like, if you live in the United States, you are in, um, you, you just live in the United States, it's the same thing. I mean, Africa, so you we want to see the South, you know, technically you only got six, you know, six countries, no, okay? six units, six directions, so you've got that completely, unless I might be mistaken, I'll box this on the screen, but let me know in the comments down below, because I need to know, guys, because this person knows how to control. But they don't know, first they don't have to spell United States. They spell unit states, whatever that unit, 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 unit states, what I did. Until the next one, we're going to work with you. OMG. I've said that many times. So, what's that? And it says, so. I don't like dolphins anymore. Squirrels are my new favourite reptiles. So cute. And I'll put one on screen now. But so cute. Um, a sample, neither a dolphin nor a squirrel is a reptile. That is true. That is absolutely true. Someone's got on, on the board that squirrel and a dolphin are not reptiles. You just, all you've got to do is just search up reptiles on Google or whatever Google said, and then let's you find your favorite reptile. I don't know what reptiles I'm thinking of, but I'll try and think of someone if my head. So, I've seen reptiles. I've just searched it up. Just had it up a bit of pause. But basically, dolphins and squirrels are not reptiles. They're different sort of animals, and they are not reptiles. I'll try and put them on the screen what a reptile is. It's somewhere on the screen. But if you know what a reptile is, it's, it's, it's a reptile. Dolphins and squirrels are not reptiles. I know that. You guys know that. But these people don't know that. So we. So you technically squirrels and dolphins just a normal different type of animal that we have in and this so just bear that in mind next time like reptiles are reptiles dolphins and animals now I will never be a reptile on to the next one it's a good thing Halloween didn't fall on the 13th of this year because that would really scare me, that would be really scary now. Now, I'll, I'm just giving me facts right here, right, right, facts right. 13th is a bad luck day, or Friday the 13th, usually it's a bad luck day, because you go, I don't know what sort of meanings, don't ask me that, you can ask me in the comments, but I've got a reply to you guys. But Friday the 13th, man, think about if it's sort of a Friday the 13th, it's they usually call it bad luck day, but not in my day, they usually call it, I don't know why. But on Halloween, it's 31st of October. 31st of October is not bad luck. 31st is Halloween. Halloween, it's not really scary if you think about it. 31st is 13th of, of whatever month you have, probably 30th of, of the 30th. It can't be bad luck. Well, it is bad luck on Halloween, but it won't be bad luck right now if you think about it. But that don't make any sense what this person's trying to say. I think this person's trying to say it. Friday the 30th is a scary thing because it's Halloween. That's what it's probably saying. Don't might be wrong, but completely out of tune. I do not know why. But, guys, don't listen to people what they say on the internet because they don't, they ain't always right anyway. So don't, don't let them fool you and don't let them 
bought into some line. I do the next one with my little side here. Okay, my quick IQ is 132 watch yours. Before we even get on, don't give anybody your details or, or anybody, because that will turn into, let's do it, let's, I can't say the word because I get monetized, but you know, don't any, give anybody your, your information or who you read, or apart from your real name, but I'm just telling you your real name, don't tell them what your age is or whatever, because that is part of your identification. So, somebody bought me. My Q is 132. What's yours? Only 1 in 50 is as smart as I am. Crazy. Yes, you're probably thinking, what crazy are you on about? Uh, so important is what is an IQ? Now I'll try and put a definition of, if not, I'll put it in the comments and I'll see, tell you guys what an IQ is. I will let you guys, let, just let me know in the comments what they are, because I don't know what it means. So important, this thing, it stands for an impossible question, but I have to double check. Well, you better double check that answer, because I don't think it's, I don't think it's an important question, or a good question. I don't IQ is, but let me know in the comments down below what is an IQ. I don't know, I'll probably find out after when I finish this editing video. But I don't really know what IQ stands for, and I haven't got a really good clue. So, um, and I'll, I'll be honest with you, I don't think it's an important question. Probably all you guys thinking, yeah, it's not an important question because it's, it's not, it's not really. I'll turn to the next one. Now, this one sort of makes me crazy, and I'm not being full, but. Okay, okay, so the next one. Name a country without the letter in the name. So basically, it's, if you know what that is, it's not the first A, it's not the first. Name a country without a letter of starting with A in it. Like, for example, for example, England, Belgium, well, Cyprus, there's loads more, but people on it, I'm going to read all these out here, like, I'll read them out, but be on the screen, I might, it could be on the screen. Some poor, Virginia, Europe, London, Europe, 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 Hungary, Europe, Africa, Tibet, Hong Kong, London. My country is England, but someone put I-G-I-N-G-L-A-N-D, so it's about England wrong. Um, uh, Mississippi, Texas, Ireland, Kansas, Car and Florida. Probably say if I'm pronouncing the wrong na names. New York, Tokyo, Mississippi, and Denmark, and Nigeria. Now, some of these at the bottom has got it right, I think. I'll put it on the screen. But so it's a name of country, but at letter A in it. So they sort of got it right, but a couple of them hasn't got the right idea. Because everybody thinks, oh, that, um, I think it says at the start in the name. So, you, for example, Argentina, that's got anything that you can't use that. Africa, that's got anything you can't use that. Argentina, I've got to think about all these countries in my head. That's, and all these got A's in them, and there's plenty more going along. But these people says one one or two, or maybe a couple, them dumb. They took the I at their soul, at these proper names like England. There's some of these, uh, they're just completely dumb. No, obviously don't take this to the this is not a serious video, but you need to, it says the name of country with an A at the start, an A in the name, so basically it's in the, in the name at the start of the sentence. So nobody can, can't get that wrong, you can't, because, I mean, you can choose England, you can choose any of us, basically saying, you, know, you can't choose all the A's for the countries. People and some of these, the, 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 they ain't got countries in. I mean, Texas ain't a country, Florida ain't a country. Well, it is a country, but it's not a, a continent, whatever you call them. Um, what else? Virginia, what is that all about? And no, it's not a naughty word, I'm not going to pronounce that because it, it, but it's like. So, I'll do the next one, move on, Um. Someone says, what, obviously be on the screen right now, what type of cat is this? Now, it's not a cat, just let it, it's not a cat. It's a sloth. It'd be on the screen, obviously, I'm not 
and it's gonna be edited all over. So I don't think I'm talking to invisible pictures. There's not nothing there. There is there somewhere in there. But so somebody put like it's it's what type of cat is this now? Unless you haven't got your glasses on, you need to look at that picture properly, or it's got contact lenses or whatever. But that what I was just showing is not a cat. Everyone think you know what it is. It's a sloth. Might be wrong. Let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget from halfway through this video or some point in this video. Don't forget to like this video and don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to turn on the bell because you never miss an upload of mine. And we still can always good. Well, it's making me mad sometimes. These dumb these people some diet them. Them just dumb people on the internet. Okay, so on the so on the bot got a new number. Little winky face probably text me the text me for the number. Now. I don't know if this is, I might be wrong, I might have got the facts right, but if you've got a brand new number, you need to send them, your number, to them, because they can't contact you with the people, they are making me mad, even though it's not trying to, it's not trying to mad challenge you, but, not being funny, you need, if you've got a brand new phone, or a brand new number, or a brand new SIM card, and you, and, you, and you say to people on social media, give me your phone numbers. Or give me, or give me on, or, or text me on my new number. Text me for the number. You call, read. You, you can't text. You can't ask someone. It's like saying to someone, "Oh, buy me something," and you go to the shop, and then you don't have no money on you. That, that's how you can say that. But you need to ask if you've got a brand new SIM or a brand new phone or whatever. You need to tell everybody your new number. Don't start asking to text me your new number. That is that don't mean the work out, does it? Not let me know in the comments down because I want to know. We've got we'll do one last one before we end this video. So last one for today. I'm moving on the side. No, I found a phone from the 90s with a hashtag. Twitter wasn't even invented. Then why did they need a hashtag back then? And somebody put that's no, what's that weird? And so put on. No, what's that weird? So basically, in the 90s, well before I was in, I was born in the 90s, everybody who is my age was born in the 90s as well. They didn't have any hashtags in the back in the day, in the 90s. That's why, I don't know, that. back in the 90s, they had hashtag, they had all these Twitters, Facebook, a lot really, until us lot has, until today really, because people like to have, like, they really, really, really like, they have hashtags. You probably is weird because everybody, some of these old pa our parents or your parents who are still alive, then would let's be like I don't know. So yeah, that's probably weird. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, I'm gonna end this video now. If you enjoyed this video, please please subscribe to my channel, like this video, and don't forget to turn on the little bell so you will never miss an upload. Don't forget if you want to see more of the reactions. Let me know in the comments because I would love to know. I'll see you all guys in my next video. Peace and goodbye.